Hey guys, today we're taking a look at the Convert Fire Control Group. In no way, shape, or form is this video giving you guys legal advice of any kind. So uh, in the end, this is completely up to you and what you want to do as a person and to decide what you want to do with your own firearm. Whether you build something like this that is completely compliant with all of your state laws or you uh, build something like these two, uh, that is completely up to you. But what I do want to do is show you guys what I think is probably one of the best options on the market right now for those of you that have to uh, follow a lot of these crazy guidelines with your firearm to make them somewhat kind of still similar to these. So what is really cool about this and probably the number one big benefit with this system is the fact that you were able to keep all of your features of your gun without having to have that crazy fin back here with the grip. You have your detachable mag, you have your collapse, collapsible stock, you have your flash hider, you can have a foregrip, you can have your accessories, you can actually have bolt locked back. Uh, believe it or not, this is actually a compliant California rifle uh, and you'll see that in the shooting that we do and everything but this gun right here this full setup you can have in California with this system and that is one of the coolest things about it so this works very similar to how your normal safety selector would on this side it is just the same the biggest difference is how this one is up here and I'm gonna explain that here in just a second I love companies like this because everyone could just go about their day and say you know what I'm just not going to worry about those states because it's things they have a bunch of rules we'll worry about the people that have uh, guns like these but what's cool about this is this company Company took the time and the energy to be able to go and basically stick it to the man and say hey here you go screw your rules we're going to try and make something like this and make this as good as possible for those of you that are trying to follow all the guidelines so really cool of this company to do that I'm actually gonna show you guys some footage here at the range actually shooting it to show you guys uh, how it works this was my first time actually handling this so I'm sure if I had more time with it and played around with it more I'd be able to be a lot quicker so I'm sure a lot of you if you get one of these you'll be able to uh, get pretty proficient with it so uh, here's that video real quick I'm out here at the range with something I think you California guys are really going to like. So I made my AR-15 here and turned it into a California compliant gun. And this is what it looks like being California compliant by using the safety selector from Convert. So what's really cool about this is all you have to do is add the safety selector and you are still able to keep all of your features that you want to keep on your rifle. So we're gonna go over, shoot it real quick. I'll show you exactly how it works in action and then we'll see how quick we can do it and do some transitions, some other things with it. All right, so to make this as legit as possible, I have my adorable little California compliant magazine. And there we go. So we'll charge the gun. You're gonna put it on fire. And then as you can see here, I cannot fire the gun again. I guess that makes it into a single shot. You rotate, it allows you to have the reset, back to fire, and so on and so forth. So super, super different, but a really cool design to allow you to be able to actually have access to your gun and all of your accessories or features of your gun. So now let's go ahead and uh, kind of do a quick transition. We'll go through some and just see how quickly we can actually shoot this and how functioning it is. So you put it back on safe. And So one nice thing is you're still able to have your bolt lock back, you're able to have your bolt release. So those are nice features as well you're able to keep by running the system. So as you can tell, that is pretty cool. Now, for those of you that are not from California, I believe New York or those other states that have these insane laws, you might not understand this setup and think it's insane. And uh, me, myself, I also think it's kind of crazy that we have to do these things. But again, what I want to do is show you guys all your options. And if you want to follow all the guidelines and be able to have the most out of your rifle there and be able to follow all the rules, this to me is probably one of the best systems. Now for pricing and what you get, this is going to be $195 on their website. You're going to receive a trigger group and a safety selection. 
selector. So you're going to remove your trigger that you have, you're going to put your trigger in, and then you're going to put the safety selector in, and you're going to be able to use this in a California type place with all those laws. Now, what's really cool about this system is if you uh, end up moving from California to another state that's actually allows you to have cool guns like these, all you would do is remove one of the pieces of the trigger, put the other piece back in, and it turns it back into a normal gun, and it will not be uh, single fire anymore, and you can use this as a normal safety selector. So uh, it is very easy to change out depending where you're at or if you move or you just go somewhere for uh, training you can just switch it out real quick run it like you normally would then when you go back to california you put the piece back in and it's going to work again like a single shot so their website has a lot of legal information so i suggest if you are from one of these states that is going to purchase one of these and use it i highly suggest you read all that information and get really proficient with it so you know uh, what you're doing all the legalities of everything and i really could tell that they put a lot of work into this before releasing it so you don't have to do much work all you have to do is read it and really understand uh, the system and all the features that you can add to it. Like I said, out the range is cool because you're able to have your bolt hold open so you're able to run malfunctions like you normally would, unlike some of them where you have to actually detach the back pin and drop the lower and do a bunch of really goofy things. The company was nice enough to give me a discount code to give to you guys. So if you want to purchase this system, you can save a little bit of money. It's going to be a 10% off discount. It's going to be code Tactical Advisor if you want to use that and decide you want to purchase this. With all that being said, I hope this helps answer some questions for you to make a decision if this is a good purchase or something that you would like to pass on and go with something else, help you make a better purchase decision. But something I never thought I would ever do is take one of my rifles and convert it to a California compliant gun or a single shot gun. Uh, but here we are, uh, we, <laughs> we did it. I just want to give you guys the best options. Again, no legal advice at all. I'm not telling you that you have to do this route. You can do whatever you want. I think that the rules and the laws of these states are unconstitutional like most of us. And I think it's absolutely ridiculous. And I think you should be able to own uh, either of these guns in those states and do whatever you want. But unfortunately, if you live in those states and you want to comply with the rules, uh, I just want to be able to give you the best options for you and to help you out. If you guys would like to help out the channel and the things I do here, there's a couple ways to do that down in the description. There are some discount codes from companies that I trust along with this company if you want to use that one. And then there is a link to my website from there are other links like uh, Brownells Air Precision from your body armor. Anything you purchase using those link does help out the channel and uh, I really appreciate it. If not, I just appreciate you guys liking, sharing, and subscribing, using the notification bell. Those things also help a ton. I really like having a conversation with you guys in the comment section and being able to connect with you guys a little bit. Uh, I did a live video video the other day that was really neat to be able to actually answer questions as they were coming in so I might do another one of those soon if you guys are interested let me know and I will uh, do another live video just to be able to communicate a little bit more with you guys other than that a couple companies that support me and the things I do are Howitzer and TA Targets Howitzer is an awesome clothing company that has actually donated uh, over a million dollars to charity really cool and they're continuing to do so many things for the community I really appreciate these guys I actually have my own t-shirt coming out here soon I will keep you guys updated another company is TA Targets pretty much the only targets I use at my range love these guys and the things they stand for Cotec Tactical Advisor will save you 10% off your order if you decide to go uh, with their targets. Other than that, guys, if you are interested, I have a full video on this gun. Uh, this is kind of one of my dream setups that I did uh, last year. I think I finished this one. But if you guys are curious about all the parts and what I chose and why I chose it, you can take a look at that video here. And then I'll probably be doing a video here soon about this one. So I just finished this. Used to be a little bit different. My handguard ended like right here and the suppressor was like here. So it was a little bit goofier. It's like everything was really crammed down. I didn't like how small everything was. Uh, I ended up getting a much longer handguard, 15 inch from Midwest Industries, pushed everything out here have my flashlight out at the end so it's not such a shadow anymore enclosed system I'm actually going to be doing a video on how uh, hot it gets in the handguard and if it's a smart idea to do an enclosed uh, suppressor so look out for that video here soon but I'll be getting a new SP tactical brace for this here shortly and I'll be switching some things up with this system so if you guys are curious about this video this will probably come out soon later I don't know I'm not sure when I'll be able to post I've got a lot of things coming in uh, Smith & Wesson sending me a couple of things to test uh, CZ IWI uh, Zev, I've got a lot of guns coming in here uh, all at one time it seems like. So I'm doing a ton of testing and trying out new products and I hope you guys stick around. I appreciate you all. Thank you so much.